What's up guys, it's your girl Selena Marie and I'm back with another video. Now today's video is a little different, it's a lot different because I ain't never touched on a topic like this. Um, X has passed away yesterday. Several gunshots possibly drive by. No description on the subject. Someone in a black BMW crazy because not too long before he passed away he was on instagram live and he was just talking and he was just basically speaking this into existence and saying how that he wanted to still be an inspiration to the younger kids who suffer from depression or who's going through stuff who needs uplifting and positivity in their life thing comes to worst i fucking die a tragic death or some shit and i'm not able to see out my dreams i at least want to know that the kids perceived my message and were able to make something of themselves and able to take my message and use it and turn it into something positive and to to at least have a good life i at least if i'm gonna if i'm gonna die or ever be a sacrifice i want to make sure that my life made at least five million kids happy or they found some sort of answers or resolve in my life Regardless of the negative around my name, regardless of, of the bad things people say to me, I don't give a fuck. Because I know my goal in the end and I know what I want for everyone and I know what my message is. So I just wanted to say I appreciate and love all of you and I believe in you all. Do not let your depression make you. Do not let your body define. So that still like gives me the creeps. Like I cannot believe that he posted this video. And then later on, or I don't know exactly how long it was before the drive-by supposedly happened and he was murdered, but it's crazy. And that leads me to say, watch what you say, you guys, and always listen and pay attention because you, a lot of people that has passed away that I know, they always say something about them passing away and some or uh, them dying or some kind of weird shit. The fuck out. I'm not playing around with suicide, especially since I had a girl kill herself in my fucking hotel room not even two to three months ago. Everybody needs to chill the fuck out. It's not cool to make assumptions. Relax. Nobody around in my camp claimed I was dead. Nobody said I was dead. The caption is not, was not. And it always ends up coming to pass, so that's crazy. Um... I want to give my condolences to his mother and his family because I know that she is devastated right now and I could not imagine the pain that she is going through. Um, like I said, this is the number one thing trending on Twitter. Um, I seen Kanye West tweet about it, little Pump talking about it. It's like and so many fans are hurt and in pain and it just crazy the shade room they're getting dragged because they posting um ever pay advertisements about hair and clothes and other bull crap and the fans are going in about it y'all they like Are you really worried about this when X just died? He 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 just died. It's been 20 minutes. I'm talking about it was like every time I refresh my news feed, it was like 20 minutes, 15 minutes, five minutes. They just going in for hours and hours and hours. And the crazy thing is, this was like it happened so fast, y'all. It was like all I seen for the first 30 minutes was like pray for X and all of this, and then like. 20 minutes later, it was like he was gone. Just that fast. Listen, it's a shooting. Shooting. Reaper Motorsports, 3671, North Dixon Highway, Chop it up. And it's like. He was trying to change his life around. Like, he had a bad past. And at first, I didn't really get jiggy with him because he was always in the all I seen was mug shots um 
bad media, bad, bad things in the media about on social media. So I just really didn't get jiggy with him. But the last few months, I had been paying attention to him because I had seen that he was trying to be positive and ch change. And we all deserve a chance to change. You know, who are we to judge another person on their past? Because we all got a past, I'm sure. It just, people know how to hide it. And, you know, people be, and it's people who suffer with depression all the time. And I am one of them. It's people who suffer from depression all the time, and they're good at hiding it. So that's a, like a subject nobody really like to talk about. So I'm just, I'm still like shook. Like I can't believe just that fast. And the images of him slumped over in that car is like replaying over and over and over in my head. Listen, it's a shooting, shooting. Reba Motorsports, 3671, North Dixon Highway, talking over. I don't think I will ever forget that. And to me, I think that's wrong. Like, why would you have him? Why would you even have him on social media like that? Why would somebody put that on social media? Him in the car slumped over like that. With no post. No post at all. To me, the family, I'll be... There'd be a lawsuit going on. I'd be trying to figure out some kind of way to get justice for my son because right there, that that was filed right there. Yeah, nobody should have images of that. No, I don't think that was right. But um, I seen the positive things that he was trying to do. I see that he was trying to make a change, and I had started liking him. I had started listening to his music. Well, I only heard one song, but. Now I'm going to go back and listen to his music and see, you know, because a lot of people say that they want to remember him as a legend. And, uh, you know, I'm not going to take that from him because, like I said, I didn't really know of him like that. I had recently started getting into him because of his past. So I'm not going to take that from him. I'm just going to investigate and see because, like I said, I noticed the change in the positivity that he was speaking out. And then the crazy thing, he had a charity event this weekend. He was in Florida. He was doing a, I think it was in Florida. He was doing a charity, um, a charity event. And all of this happened right before that, right before that. It sent shockwaves through me when he say, if I die a horrible death or if... I end up a sacrifice. I just want my name to be remembered. If thing comes to worse, I fucking die a tragic death or some shit, and I'm not able to see out my dreams. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna die or ever be a sacrifice, I want to make sure that my life made at least five million kids happy. For all the kids out there who suffer from depression needs positive input i mean it just it just get, make my heart just flutter um if you enjoyed this video go ahead give this video a fat thumbs up if you're new to the channel go ahead hit that subscribe button join the loyalty gang the loyalty squad <clears throat> my voice is going off i need to go drink some water turn your post notifications on hit that bell so you won't miss any videos i love you guys Tell the villain like I'm rapping a damn lie Tell the villain like my life is a damn game If you really wanna die in the nighttime